What's up, Roadie Foodie fam? We are back out here, guys. Welcome to another video. My name is Lupe. Please like, comment, subscribe. We're gonna do, I hate using the word review, but basically, this is the new new from the Dunkin' of the Donuts. Actually, they're called just Dunkin' now. You see, you don't see, you don't see the word donuts anymore anywhere. So this is part, I got as much as I could as far as their new uh, pumpkin spice uh, fall menu as much as I can. I did get some notes here also. So I'm gonna just describe everything real quick. Pumpkin spice latte, iced. I was really sad. I thought it was gonna come with like a drizzle. I saw like a photo somewhere online that had a little drizzy. Uh, then we got some of the donuts. We got a muffin and then the sandwich has been popping long. Ah! I'm so freaking hungry. Haven't eaten yet. You guys know how I roll. Guys, this is probably, I think that this is my first um, latte. <laughs> I think this is my first latte. I don't know. Let's get into it. Oh, uh, first of all, you know how we do it. All right, down the hatch. Oh, man. Oh, uh, you know what? I know, I know society always makes fun of, like, being basic, but that's pretty good. Oh man, that is good. I, you know what? I think deep down inside, guys, I'm basic. Shh, don't tell, don't tell my friends. All right, so new signature pumpkin spice latte, uh, pumpkin spice uh, available hot cold, guys. You guys already know I run hot, so I had to get the cold jump off. Uh, basically, vanilla flavors, top of whipped cream, caramel drizzle. Didn't get the drizzy, and I did not get my cinnamon sugar topping. I don't know what store this is. I don't want to put <laughs> I don't want to put them on blast, but I did not get my drizzy and I did not get my little my little topping, my little sugar. Ah, uh, that's good though. All right guys, I love me some donuts. So basically this is the um wait. I think I got both of them. Yeah, the the apple cider and then the pumpkin donut. I'm going to go with pumpkin first. Man, it, in my car right now, it's <laughs> it smells like October first. Look at that down the hatch. Mmm. I'm telling you, you glaze anything in this world, I'm gonna eat it. Mmm. That's a fresh donut too. What a good combo. Hold on. I'm one of those people, guys, that when I eat, sometimes I like to put a little liquid in there, too, right? If you're, like, eating, like, a taco, right before it ends, I throw a little soda on there, hydrate it up. So this is, like, this is almost like dunking it in the latte. Right now. Mm. Honestly, I feel like going pumpkin picking right <laughs> Loop is too early for pumpkin picking. No, it's not. All right. Now, I've gone to... People on the East Coast would, would know what this is. I've gone to a place called The Big E which is like this huge, I don't even know what to call it. It's like a fair, but it's like a fair on drugs. And they have this one stall there that I go visit every single time that has apple cider donuts. And they also, uh, they make like cider and stuff. Oh, here we go. Nice size donut, down the hatch. Mmm. You know how to jazz that up? You put that in the microwave for like 10 seconds. Get it nice and warm. It's a little dry for my liking. But the taste is there. All right. Oh. Mm. Okay. Yeah, I can taste the apple. All right. 
Now, this is the what? What do we have here? Obviously, it's a muffin. This is the pumpkin muffin. Also, guys, I was going to get the, um, they have like donut holes and they have all kind of like pumpkin flavored coffees. I was going to get a frozen one too, but I was like, yeah, <laughs> I'm already like wired on life. Like, ah, I don't need to be like way up here. All right, muffins. This is going to be so, okay. We got to live in the muffin lane here. Here we go. Beepity boop, bobbity bops. I love my muffin. All right, how do you guys eat your muffin? That says a lot about a person. Does it, Lupe? Not really. All right, I wanted to give you guys that inside. Look at that good, look at that good color. That's that good, good, down the hatch. Okay, I wanted to try the side before I eat in the frosting. They're so adorable. Mm. Same thing. I would heat this up. But it has all the flavor you need in there. That's what I'm talking about right here. Guys, I haven't gone pumpkin picking. One, two, three, about three years. Who wants to take me? <laughs> Who wants to take me pumpkin picking? Also, my photographer friends right now are loving the season. Not right now with all the rain, but this is the season where you get those beautiful fall, autumn photos. The trees are still, still greenish, but in about a month, this is the part, this is the year, I'm sorry, this is the time of year that where I live in New England, right? I don't know where everybody's watching this video from. A lot of you guys are obviously in Rhode Island, but a lot of you are from outside of New England. This fall is literally my favorite time of year and it's because of the foliage I can't even say the word foliage there you go that's when you see all the like the oranges and the reds and the oh that that itself is what keeps me here along with the food but it's literally guys I am the humidity is gone get the f out of here son Make room for my pumpkins! <laughs> Alright. See what happens when you give me caffeine? Okay. A little bit of that. A little bit of that. What are we doing right here? Well, I'm going to read it verbatim for you guys. This is off the internet. We have a maple sugar bacon breakfast sandwich. I got five half slices, five half slices, what does that mean? I don't know what that means. Of maple sugar, seasoned bacon, egg, white cheddar. Oh, white cheddar. They went with white cheddar? Where's the white cheddar? Oh, it's on the bottom. Served on a warm, flaky croissant. I have to be in the mood for croissants, guys. I was ready to eat a croissant, and then the lady in the intercom was like, how would you like that? On a bagel? And I was like, oh, yes, I get to choose. So here we go. And you guys let me know, are you team bagel? Are you team English muffin? Are you team flaky croissant? I have to be in the mood for certain things. Today, you guys know where I'm living. Oh yeah, is this the same bacon that? Mm. Guys, bacon is where I Bacon's where I live. I live in Bacon, USA. Oh, look at that cheese right there, right on the top. There we go. This is when I know when falls here is when all the pumpkin, all the spice, all the apple, everything starts coming out, guys. 
literally, you know, you're gonna see me the most happiest you will ever see me on this channel is during the fall time. Don't match. Mm. That's a that's a decent amount of bacon right there. Mm. Something about maple, guys. One of my favorite states in New England. Because I haven't traveled to every single state, which I want to. That's part of the Roadie Foodie future vlogs, right? Is I want to travel to all 50 states and just eat my way through. But Vermont, <clears throat> Vermont has a super, super special place in my heart. Mmm. Mmm. All right, that item right there, I am going to order again tomorrow for breakfast. You just get that that sugarness from, you know what I like too? I don't know if they're putting, they put pepper on it too? I don't know. Give you guys that QVC move. Look at that. Mmm. I really love breakfast sandwiches, right? <clears throat> you put that together like that, como se llama? Mm. Here we go. Empty parking lot. We got somebody coming over here. How are you? There he is. <laughs> For people that are new to this channel, when I park in abandoned parking lots, somebody, I'm surprised they didn't park right here, right next to me. Mm. So guys, essentially, if you love pumpkin, if you love apple cider, if you love the fall, if you love roti food, <laughs> look, that has nothing to do with it. All right, you're right. Mm. Man, New England loves his Dunkin' Donuts, and you can see why. Coming out with some good stuff. Come with some bangers. You got a grown man <laughs> drinking pumpkin spice lattes over here. Now, every time I go, I'm gonna have to be like, yeah, pumpkin spice latte. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Can I get pumpkin spice? <laughs> can I get pumpkin spice latte with whipped cream, please? Like, so we can't hear you. Be like, all right, you know what? Just give me regular coffee then. Hot. Black. Actually, I can't drink black coffee like that, guys. Too bitter for me. I know some of you maniacs out there love that. Mmm. That's it. That's what we got. I love their branding. They have such good branding. I mean, look at this. If you like somebody, write them a little note on this. Give it a boot. Or leave it out as like a subliminal <laughs> message. Be like, love notes, how are you? Okay. Let's wrap it up here for the new new. Muffin, good. I would heat it up. Just to give it that little moisture inside, right? You know, when you heat things up, the steam. Same thing with the apple cider, uh, cider, uh, almost said apple cider vinegar. Apple cider donut. The pumpkin donut was, you know why? Because it was glazed and glazed is life. This thing right here was the heater. <sighs> the 
This one. <laughs> oh, you can see the, um, the, I don't know if that's like the pumpkin spice or not. Right here. Ah, oh, that is good. Actually, I might try a, um, a pumpkin flavored like, I used to love the culottas, and I think they got rid of them. But um, I'll, I'll eat my way through the menu for you guys. Uh, hopefully you guys like this little, I hate using the word review, the new new here at Roadie Foodie. This is just some of their items. They have, again, they have like donut holes and then, which some people call them donut holes in New England. We call them munchkins. They're basically the little, the little round inner part of them. Uh, but that sandwich was, this thing was, so if you guys love breakfast sandwiches, you want to rush, you next to a Dunkin', get that sandwich, get one of these. This is the medium. This is big, though. You can get a large or, or a small, rather. But that was really good. I'll come back again. I love you guys. Like, comment, subscribe. Um, we, as far as Roadie Foodie goes, um, you know, we're still trying to... <laughs> It's, it's so weird not to have a set schedule yet of going to a local restaurant every single day and trying to mix in the other elements of our of our channel, like vlogs and uh, new national items and cooking. And you guys saw the Cheeto. Uh, Cheetos came out with a new mac and cheese. We did that video yesterday or the day before. I'm, all these days are blending together. Um, <clears throat> so hopefully you guys like that. And then just, uh, again... We love comments. We we reply uh, mostly to everybody. You know, sometimes we'll <laughs> we'll get like we'll get like a message or a, a comment from like the same person like three or four times, and we're like, oh my god, hold, which one do we reply to? <laughs> ah, beep, beep, boop. Um, so like, comment, subscribe, guys. We love you. We're uh, on our way. We have surpassed eighteen hundred. We're on our way to nineteen hundred. And then we're waiting till uh, 2,000 subscribers to do uh, Instagram Live. Instagram Live. Oh, my God, guys. I'm so tired. I have so much happening in my personal life right now that I'm just trying to keep it all together. Um, that uh, 2,000 uh, YouTube Live. And then also uh, Camilla started a OnlyFans, and then, which inspired me to start an OnlyFans also. So we're going to start doing some exclusive content there, maybe some sneak peek stuff over there uh that'll be kind of more of like vloggy style so if you like that more than like the mukbangs uh but we will be doing some exclusive mukbangs on our only fans page also and all that all that information is down below in the description uh we love you guys be well eat well and take care of each other ciao